Every year at Dias Air Force Base, Halloween fans come together to build the youth center's haunted house. Airman First Class Hannah Dopel couldn't wait to get involved. I am a big fan of Halloween. I most definitely. I'm, I'm very much one of those people where I can't go with a simple costume. I have to give it 110%. So what does 110% mean? Well, setup starts just days before the haunted house opens to the public, so volunteers have to work very quickly. The rooms host different themes, and A1C Dopel's room is exceptionally creepy. My character, my room, is the doll room. You know, best way to describe it really would be, you know, picture Shirley Temple with the grudge girl. Uh, I've got my buddy over here in this corner. He's usually sitting here. He's all tied up and asking people for help when they come through, and then I pop out and skin living the Jesus out of them. You wanna play? <laughs> so what does it all look like when it comes together? Let's take a look. From setup to teardown, the haunted house only exists for one week a year. But the house leaves quite an impression on anyone brave enough to go through. Oh my gosh, it was great! Scared the crap out of me. Scared me. Scared me to death. <laughs> I hope they do it again next year. Just as awesome, if not better. Reporting from Dias Air Force Base, I'm Airman First Class, Corey Schuler.